can I just tell you, I've been looking forward to this presentation for two months. Since the first time I saw it in our toy style out here at QVC, this is the Razor Crazy Cart Shuffle Kid Powered. Wait a minute, I'm riding this right now. All right, we'll talk about that in a second. It is powered by the person riding it. How's that? This is gonna be one of the hottest quote unquote toys of the entire season, friends, and we just got it in stock. What is it? Well, let me back up and tell you what it's not. It's not anything that requires a charge. You don't need a battery, you don't need a cord. You don't need to learn how to play it like you do a video game. In fact, what you need to do is do what we used to do when we were little kids. Remember when your parents used to tell you, go outside, don't come back in until the street lights came on. Don't come back in until you smell dinner cooking, right? And you used to go, yay! because I get to go outside and play. Guys, you get to go outside and play and you can even do spins in this as well. I've been riding this for about 10 minutes. That's how long it took for me to get the hang of it. And we finally have it here. Boy, something like this must cost like 300 bucks or something, right? Because it looks like it's that big fancy toy. It's $99.98. You get the first look. Oh, and by the way, it's tool free. This is how you power it, only your kids aren't gonna be wearing high-heeled shoes. So guess what, you don't even need to know how to do that. Ali, can you spin on in here for me, buddy, and show me your invention. Guys, Ali Kermani is gonna join us right now. He is Razor Scooter's first ever employee Whoa. and a bit of a show off as well. Come on, by the way, he's also a famous skateboarder. He's got moves named <laughs> after him. But his mission is to create toys, I put it in quotes, that kids of all ages, I mean four and up, can use. Ali, welcome to QVC. We're so thrilled to have you here. You, you should have seen me goofing off on this during the style out. I was like knocking Christmas trees over. It was <laughs> hilarious. And I couldn't wait to get this in. We have our kids, uh, Olivia and Noah here as well, to show you that kids, like the little ones, actually do far better than the grown-ups on this. Hi, Olivia. Hi, Noah. You guys are doing great over there. Ali, tell me about this. How did it come about? So this is a follow-up to the Crazy Cart, the original Crazy Cart that right. was my master's thesis, and I launched oh, wow. it 10 years ago, became Jeez. Toy of the Year. That was an electric go-kart, and this is the first kid-powered version of that. So no batteries to maintain, uh, no, no worries about you know, the charge being dead, um, and also the price obviously is significantly lower. It's ridiculous, right? Because this is steel construction, it, it rolls smoothly, and when you Thank lift you. the handles up, like you, Ali's doing. You spin around, you exactly. You spin around, right? Yes. Okay. So full disclosure, this is rated to 120 pounds, all right? Your girl JC is, um, <clears throat> I'm just a, a tinge over that, all right? So keep that in mind, and it's for ages four and up. That said, I couldn't resist. I had to get on it. Be sure you wear a helmet. Be sure you take all the safety precautions. But guess what you don't need is a whole lot of skill and a whole lot of practice. I'm getting updates here, and it goes like this. We had 1,600. Now we have 1,500. These are flying. Use that easy pay. A lot of you are picking up more than one. Why? Because it's less than $100. And because once you get on it, you're never going to get off it. Can we join the kids? Yes, absolutely. Yes, look at me. I'm scooting up. I'm getting good at this, guys. OK, I'm not going to be. You guys are synchronized now. Did you realize <laughs> that? Did you see those spins? They were doing them at the same time. Noah, how old are you, honey? You're six, you're doing great. Olivia, how old are you? You're eight and you're doing great. And I'm 48 and I'm just trying to figure out how this, I think we're doing a pretty good job. Ali, you wrote your master's thesis on go-karts? I did and you know what the best part is, is now I have my own children and that's who I designed this product for, it's for my own kids. And they're, uh, they're the testers and, uh, and, and like Noah and like Olivia, you know, they're loving it and take right to it. And you know why I love it like as a parent is because this is a physical activity I mean, it's actually a pretty good ab workout, I'm not gonna <laughs> lie, right? We're burning calories, we're learning hand-eye coordination. How, how did you do that spin? How did you do that spin? Here, let's show you. All right, you show me. Okay, both of you show me. So, you, I, I do the wiggle with my feet, but how do I make it spin? You lift the handles up, that's right. That's so great, you're doing great. Hey, Ali, um, what do I do when I get home? What kind of tools do I need? So you don't really need tools. Everything that you need comes no with the kit. Tools. It also has a tool list adjustment, which lets you change or select between five lengths. So the product grows with your child. It's great for any kid that's four to 14. Over here. And it's been designed to make not only the kids happy, but also the parents. It's very low maintenance. It's, as you can hear, completely quiet. And it's a great way to get your kids out uh, outdoors, enjoying outdoor play, off the couch, away from screens. Okay, I can't guarantee the completely <laughs> quiet part because all I want to do is go, whee, <laughs> and look at me, right? All right, I'm going to try the spin. So I get to go and I pull the handle up. Woo! 
Incredible, that's awesome. <laughs> Ali was like, Jen, you're doing great, you're doing great. Let me show you how to, wait, how do I do the reverse? The reverse so, thing. The reverse is pretty easy. You just pull up the bars and keep your legs taut. Okay. And it'll flip you to reverse. Ah, this and is great. All right, wait, what's out. the latest, Mike? Oh God, we're half gone. Fewer than a thousand remain. Many of you are picking up more than one. Do you know why? It's a $20 bill to get it home. Do you know why? Look how big this box is. I always like to say, in my family, there was always the gift that had on the tag from Santa. It would say, open me last. And the open me last present was always the big one. It was the one that made you go, <gasps> and it was the one that made you kind of forget about all the other presents. You just Absolutely. wanted to go outside and start playing with it, right? Uh, this is the open me last. What would you think if you got this for Christmas? Mm, I have it on my wish list. Yeah, oh, <laughs> <laughs> Olivia says she has it on her wish list. And look at this. I, I am actually pretty impressed that all four of us, we haven't bumped into each other. There's no like bumper car situation. Are the seats pretty comfortable? Because I'm pretty comfy, right? You recline. Oh, wait, I have another question. Yes. What if you have, um, it's like a 10 year old and they're pretty tall? Um, so the, the, the size is adjustable and also your knees are bent. So they absorb a lot of the height. We actually have a designer at Razor, six foot five. He hops in it and six runs around. Six foot five? Yes, not, I wouldn't say that's yeah. the, the, the comfort zone, <laughs> but he does, he is able to do it. Right. If you have an early puberty situation on one of the kids, then I think you're still pretty good, right? Because you can adjust it to different heights and different sizes. So again, obviously it's been tested to far higher than 120 pounds, but to yes. keep it on the safe side, your weight limit is 120 pounds. It doesn't mean you're probably not gonna sneak a ride, right? <laughs> okay, if we, oh, and you can have any color that you want as long as it's this teal color, okay? Because that's the only color we have. All right, guys, are we ready to head back over to the, the big area in front of the garage? Wait, I'm gonna race you, Olivia. Come on, let's see if we can, come on, come on. Here, I'll give you a little okay. boost. Oh, oh, thank you, okay, <laughs> Ali gave me a little push. All right, I cheated, kids, so you guys still win. Hey, guess what? We started with 2,000 of these. We have 600, oh no, to go around. All right. I'm getting really good at those fans. <laughs> and, and Jen, this is the world release of this product. It's not available no, anywhere it's not. other than QVC. This is the only place you're going to be able to find this. Oh my God, it's a worldwide oh. launch, guys. Do you remember when, um, well, when I was growing up, it was the Cabbage Patch Kid. I'm still bitter about it. I never got one because my mom went to every toy store imaginable. She couldn't find one because they were completely sold out. Do I smell another situation happening here with this? Yes, I do. If you've got the first ever on its way, it's not an advanced order, so guess what? If you have a kid who has a birthday coming up this summer, go ahead and gift this to them, or a big kid with a birthday. All right, guys, we got one minute left. Show me all your tricks. This is show off time. All it's okay right. if you bump into it, it's all right. <laughs> Woo, we got the spins, we got the reverse, we got coo coo crazy times going. All that we're missing is the roller rink music. All right, guys, you know what to do. You can use your camera to scan the QR code, and it'll take you straight to the item that you see. Use that easy pay. And if you get it home, I feel silly even saying this. If you get it home and you don't love it by the end of January, you can send it back. LOL, none of these are gonna come back. <laughs> Olivia and Noah, I wanna say you guys did a great job. Thank you so much. Oh, and Ali, yeah, he did a great job too for inventing the darn thank thing. So Ali, much. thank you so much. Guys, we have fewer than 200 of these to go around, so it's gonna sell out. You're gonna need to be quick on QVC.com or call us. I'm gonna keep working on my spins, but Mike says I have to voice something, so. What do you mean the voice here? <laughs> what? No, you did great. Great job, guys. Thank okay. You. Thank you, hon. All right.